<clears throat> Hi, this is the design of polarity communicating about polarity. Now, as all have become aware who have participating with destiny is that polarity is, for instance, the equation jump of the definition of two separate manifestations which exist in polarity expressions, such as love and hate and war and peace and there are many. Conflict, calmness, you have religion, you have atheists, you have cultures believing in this, cultures believing in that. Now, polarity has been designed and manifested and created within this mind consciousness existence to create friction. So, you have the two polarity equations, and human beings jump within and as polarities in their mind constantly and continuously, from one to the other, from one to the other, and the whole time they're playing this tennis ball game within themselves, with themselves in their mind, and within the rest of the world. So therefore, you have the two polarities of the mind-consciousness system and the polarities that are manifested within this world. Let's take religion and atheists, for instance. There is a God. No, there isn't. There is a God. No, there isn't. Manifesting friction, continuously, constantly. Um, and that seems to pretty much very well entertain human beings human beings, this entire world, this entire mind, consciousness, systematic reality, existence, have been set up for your entertainment, to preoccupy you, to divert your attention, to divert your focus, to keep you busy, to not be here, remain here of every breath of life as who you are. Human beings, you exist in the mind, you exist in polarity. And polarity causes friction. That friction causes thoughts, emotions and feelings to originate from. How does the mind work? The mind works with polarity. That's why even Scientists apparently you've got your left and your right brain hemispheres crisscrossing and all those type of things, etc. Polarity, positive, negative, good, bad, right, wrong. It exists everywhere in this world within human beings and everyone and everything in this world is accepting it and supporting it. And it's being manifested as an actual experience within this world. So you see polarity existing in the world. Where does it come from? The mind. The mind being set up on principles of three layers. Good and bad, right and wrong, and positive and negative. Those three foundations are the foundations of the mind upon which it is established to manifest friction within your mind, because in that friction, what happens is... It causes like a lightning bolt within the center of your being. That lightning bolt activates your entire mind consciousness system within your human physical body. And you experience thoughts, feelings and emotions and you're gone. You are the mind. You are the system. For instance, a human being that is raised to become an atheist. <clears throat> To believe in no God. Believes there's no God. There is no God. A Christian is born to believe that there exists a God. 
Now these two beings are here, in front of each other, the atheist and the Christian. Within this, atheist, within this atheist's mind's belief, there is no God. Within this Christian's belief, there is a God. Now both of them are actually in the same position. Why? Although the atheist believe there's not a God and the Christian believe there's a God, not one of them are living anything. So atheist, there is no God. What do you do about it? Who are you? What are you going to do about it if you realize that there is no God? Are you taking responsibility for yourself? Question. You say there is a God. Um, so please show me and reveal to me how you're able to justify in this world as it exists now that there is a God. And you're just standing there doing absolutely nothing while this entire world continues. You're not taking responsibility for yourself. Atheist, you're not taking responsibility for yourself. Human beings hide behind their beliefs. Everything in this world has a polarity equation to it. Why? To manifest friction between human beings. To keep them preoccupied and busy. Look at this world, human being. There is friction all over. And this friction originate from the mind because families that raise their children between what is good and bad, right and wrong, positive and negative. Have a look. And then these children raise their children what's right and wrong, what's good and bad, what's positive and negative. Each one has got their beliefs in this world. And so the children will grow up positive, negative, good, bad, right, wrong. Fucked continuously going, being pulled apart like a puppet between the polarity equations of the mind and then actually experiences in this world. Human beings, there is discernment but there isn't such a thing as good and bad, right and wrong and positive and negative. It does not exist. If that exists within you, you are of the mind and you are not going to enjoy the experience of yourself in this world when you are shifted through the poles of the polarity equations of the mind which you will experience in this world and there, which will cause much friction within you and within other human beings in your world. Human beings stop conditioning and forming yourself and shaping yourself according to this world of what is right and wrong, what is good and bad, and what is positive and negative. You will fuck with yourself. Thank you very much.